What up, everybody? It's your boy Roshi here, back with another exclusive, exclusive, exclusive. Not really. I don't get anything exclusive. I always miss out on the exclusive stuff. Um, but I am going to be reviewing a figure today that is kind of sort of an exclusive. Today, I'm going to be reviewing this Funko Pop Chevron. Um, it's one of the larger pops. It's six inches. Um, and it's a Galactic Toys and Collectibles exclusive, so you won't be able to find it in any stores really, like, or anything like that. But I'm always looking out for the Broke Nigga Gang. It's not too expensive. I mean, it's about 40 bucks since, since you know, you can't really pick it up in a store. But it's still not going to break the bank if you want something dope, a nice DVZ collectible. There's not really many Shenron figures out there. Um, so, for the price, I would say this is... A good deal. Um, I've had it sitting on my shelf now for like two weeks because I've been too lazy to make this fucking video but here we are and now we're gonna get to it right the fuck now. Alright so the time has come to go ahead and get this out of its nice little box here. Alright. Shouldn't be anything hard. The pops are never hard to get out. Usually. They're pretty simple. And here we are. So, the first thing I'm going to do is kind of go around it just to make sure there's no flaws or anything or any, you know, messed up paint spots that happened to me once on uh, one of my pops. Uh, and it's not something you can really spot because, of course, it's in the box. You don't really notice it until you take it out. But this one is pretty much flawless. Uh, one thing. Two things I like to point out already just by looking at it. Um, the detailing and the scales is pretty epic. Uh, feels nice as well. Uh, the detail in the horns, the wood on the horns is also nice. So really intricate figure. It's probably the most intricate pop I own. No, it is the most intricate pop that I own. Um, now that I'm thinking about it. Um, pretty cool. Nothing about this sets pop to me except the eyes really, they did a really great job on this build quality is nice and it's pretty sturdy. Um, all in I think it was well worth the 40 bucks that I spent on it. Uh, again, it's going to cost you more since it's slightly, it's like a, a kind of like an exclusive that was, you know, made for one store. But I'm going to get into some close ups in a bit here, but before I get into those close ups, I just wanted to say, as usual, uh, the link to my store, not where I sell pops, I don't sell figures, I sell merch, uh, but the link to that is going to be down in the description. Follow me on Instagram at your boy Roshi if you don't already. And if you have any specific questions about this figure, you can go ahead and ask me in a comment and I'll be more than happy to answer you. But without further ado, I'm going to just jump right into those close-ups and I'm probably going to cut myself off while I'm talking because I feel like I'm rambling and rambling. 